Hi everyone. Uh, today we are discussing how to make 3D plots using R Studio. So here we can see that in order to make 3D plots using R, following libraries are required. First library is library plot 3D. Uh, second is RGL. Third is reader. First. Uh, if if the libraries are not already installed in your prof, uh, R Studio, you can go in Tools, Install Packages, and install that library. Like if I open the library tools, it will check for online. And if you write plot 3D, and if you press install, it will be installed in your library uh, R Studio. Then you can load this library using this command. So first of all, I will highlight these three, uh, these three libraries and uh, press Control plus Enter. So it will read the libraries and make real R Studio ready to do the tasks which are uh, relevant, which are we should be done in R. So first of all, need to read the data file. So the data file that is uh, used in this library is uh, it has three uh, three variables uh, three continuous variables and and then you can use the fourth one as a color so the data file command is that df data file is equal to this this command is also denoted as equal to read underscore csv and the directory of the file and since i have to skip first row because it has full variable names so if I execute it, it will read the data file. So if I write df, if I click the variable name, it will show me the data. In this data file, the first names are short names of the variables then the continuous or independent variables are there. So the variable that I will be using is the, the these three indicators, the sense and C's and cluster and group so here what i will be doing is the command is plot 3d so x variable is data file dollar sign means pick the data file and select the sense variable and y data file dollar sign sees variable z data file dollar sign the you know variable innovation variable and uh, which was a dependent variable originally and color color with data file group uh, one so the type uh, as uh, the there are some other variables so x label y label and the main title you can you can add any title so here i have written econistics.com tutorials and the subtitle is the 3d plot so if i highlight it and press control plus enter it will execute and it will show up in a new window so if i increase the size of this window you can see uh, a 3d plot and the advantage of this plot is that uh, you can see uh, the graph and you can just change it the way you like to do so you can see if I set it here and uh, make it straight yes a little bit straight yes so all three axes are uh, visible a uh, little bit up yes so all of the axes are available. This is sensing axis. This is seizing axis. This is innovation axis. And this is the title and this is the subtitle. If I go a little bit, uh, the way I want to present it, it's up to me. Then where you want to stop it, stop and press the print screen button and uh, copy the image in your document where you want to show it. The other advantage is that you can use this uh, dynamic document and show it in your website and anyone you can can move it to see how it is working so so this was today's session how to make 3d plots using r studio thank you very much for watching do subscribe and do suggest uh, your views regarding the videos in this platform thank you very much